The summer months are almost here, and as the spring rain clears, temperatures climb and sunny days grow longer. Attention then turns to sun protection. CBS 11 meteorologist Annalise Parks talked to experts about ways to protect yourself and your family in today's Weather 101 and some science stuff. One out of five Americans will develop skin cancer in their lifetime. Over 87% of skin cancer is attributed to overexposure to the sun. Not only is it hot in Texas, but we do have pretty intense ultraviolet light, especially in the warmer summer months. The higher the sun is in the sky, the higher the UV radiation level. So the strongest ultraviolet rays can be found around midday during the summer months. While Dr. Sklar encourages seeking shade, there are other protective measures you can take. You also want to try to use protective clothing the best you can. That includes broad rimmed hats and, if feasible, long sleeve shirts and pants, even in the Texas heat, to, pr to protect. And after that, it's just sunscreen, sunscreen, sunscreen. But just how much? The amount you should apply is about an ounce, which is about the size of a shot glass. As for what kind? Try to do at least a number SPF 30, because that gets you some good basic protections. But if you've had a lot of skin cancers in the past, family history, or sun sensitive diseases, then we'll go for the higher numbers, sometimes up to 50 to 60 or 70. A recent proposal from the FDA pushes for higher SPF options as well as better labeling. So when the consumer sees the products on the counter, it's more clearly spelled out what the SPF is, if it's, if it's a broad spectrum sunscreen, and if it's water resistant. Dr. Sklar suggests reaching for the sunscreen year round. Sometimes we get a false sense of security during the winter and cooler months that we don't need as much sunscreen or need to put any on. But we see some of the worst sunburns in our patients when there'll be an occasional sunny day in those times of year and patients don't protect. So whether you're in the dog days of summer or in the throes of winter, don't forget to lather up. For CBS 11, I'm Annalise Parks.